Toffee Hot Dogs. What's up YouTube, Sweatpants Joe here. And today's hot dog, Hoffee Hot Dogs. If you live in Los Angeles, chances are you've had Hoffee Hot Dogs. Hoffee Hot Dogs is the brand that is synonymous with Los Angeles hot dogs. If you go to the Angels games, they serve Hoffee brand hot dogs. Um, Pink's Hot Dogs uses Hoffee brand hot dogs. There's even a sign right under the Pink's Hoffee. They've been using Hoffee for years. Hoffee is Los Angeles. Today I've got the all beef Hollywood original style hot dogs. They have the natural casing beef frankfurters. I'm gonna go put these on the grill and we're gonna grill these bad boys up and then we're gonna have some Hoffee hot dogs. So here they are on the grill. This is a five pack, five for 12 ounce. It looks like it is an eight for one. That's eight for a pound size hot dog. Um, so this is the brand they use for Pink's. Pink's has their own special hot dog where it's a nine inch hot dog. And uh, this is just your standard size hot dog with a natural casing. Um, I'll zoom in. There you see there's a casing on it. So these are gonna be good. They're gonna have a nice snap to them. Okay, they're off the grill. One of them I charred really good because I love me a good charred hot dog. And today we're using Ballpark brand hot dog buns. I normally just get the generic buns, but they had an expiration date of the 1st, and these had an expiration date of the 8th, so they were fresher. I'm changing it up. I'm doing one plain and one with mustard relish and the Up the Creek West Virginia hot dog sauce. Normally I do that separately. Today I'm doing it together with all the other condiments. This is the Up the Creek Taste of West Virginia hot dog sauce, and you can buy that at upthecreekmustard.com. This is a really good hot dog sauce. It's tomato based. Um, here's your ingredients tomato puree, water, bell pepper, onions, spices, sugar, and molasses. Okay, I'm gonna do the plain one first. Hoffy hot dogs, and it's it's natural casing hot dogs. Normally, if you're like on the street and you're getting a street vendor hot dog, and they use the Hoffee brand, they use the quarter pound hot dog that doesn't have the natural casing. Now, if you go to Pink's, they're more like this. They have the natural casing, and they snap. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you hear that snap? <laughs> That's really good. That's really good. I'll put this hot dog on par with any of the Buffalo, New York hot dogs I brought back. That's really good. This hot dog will be my grocery store go-to hot dog for the remainder of my duration in Los Angeles. The natural casing snaps in every bite, and I love it. And the all beef flavor is great. Um, you could taste the quality in this hot dog. It's just really good. It's a really good hot dog. Let me try one with all of my accoutrement. Yeah, that hot dog sauce goes really good with mustard and relish. It's really good. Really good. You remember what I've said before, you, can, you have to finish a hot dog in five bites. I took three of this one already. And number five. On a scale of PU It Stinks to Sunshine Lollipops and Rainbows, I am giving the Hoffy Hot Dogs the Hollywood Original with the natural casing, and I like it a lot. They're really, really, really good hot dogs. Like I said, I put them right up there with Wardinsky, with Salen, 
uh, with Hoffman, with Zweigels. They go right. They go right up there with them. Um, Vienna Beef. I'll put them right up there with Vienna Beef. I'll put them up there with Sabrets. They're very good hot dogs, but you have to make sure you get the Hollywood Original Natural Casing Hot Dogs. The quarter pound hot dogs that they sell in the store from Hoffy, those are the ones that when you're leaving a Dodger game or you're leaving a USC game or what have you, and you see some lady on the street and she's making hot dogs with the bacon wrapped around them and she's selling them. Those are the kind of hot dogs that they'll use. They'll use those ones. And you don't really need the casing on those kind of hot dogs because you're gonna have the bacon and the peppers and the onions and the mayonnaise and the ketchup and all that. So you don't really need the casing. But if you just want a straight up hot dog, one for grilling, one for barbecuing, having hot dog with your friends, you have to go with the Hoffy Hollywood Original Natural Casing Hot Dog. For years, I've been struggling with buying hot dogs in California because I've been stuck getting the Hebrew Nationals or I've been getting the Kirkland brands or the S-Bar. Nuh-uh. Hoffy. Okay, earlier in the pandemic, I wanted hot dogs. And I went to Smart and Final and I grabbed a pack of Hoffy. And I didn't really like it all that well. And I was like, ah, oh, these kind of suck. I was cleaning out my freezer and I found them and I saw they were like the lean hot dogs, like reduced fat hot dogs. That's why I didn't like them. These hot dogs have all the fat and all the taste and all the goodness. Go with these hot dogs. You won't be disappointed. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you on the next one.